This is how not to train your car dealership staff about a safety system meant to protect pedestrians. It's okay, no one was badly hurt, no one even went to the hospital. The staff at this Volvo dealership in the Dominican Republic will probably be a little less trusting of technology, even if it wasn't the vehicle's fault. This was no evil car with its own mind, like the one in the movie Christine. Mowing down people on purpose. Volvo is still looking into it, but tells CNN that the dealership apparently thought the car was equipped with a radar and camera system that scans for pedestrians. And then automatically activates the car's full braking power if the driver fails to respond in time. So what happened with a driver behind the wheel at the dealership? The good news is that according to Volvo, the pedestrian detection system did not malfunction. The bad news is that the car wasn't actually equipped with a pedestrian detection system. And for thinking it was when it wasn't and letting staff stand there, Volvo blames the mishap on human error. Once during a demonstration for the press, a Volvo's automatic braking system failed. Volvo attributed that to a battery problem. Uh, we've had uh, some kind of mishap in the testing here. Others have challenged the pedestrian detection system for laughs. A bucket. Even using humans dressed as dummies. <laughs> but that was nothing compared to the crash course these guys got. Genimo, CNN, New York.